So Anna Marie, anytime you're ready, go ahead and pull the yellow rip cord. I didn't hear four. Four. One, two, three, four. Pull the rip cord. Okay, now you can appreciate why you don't want that belt too tight when it's it wasn't deflated. Too tight. I loosened the belt. And now it's kind of tight, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, is it too it's, uncomfortable? No. Okay, good. So what you can do is you can turn around and look like this. Lean back a little bit. Just lean back. So that way it would cradle your head. And then your chin would be up so you could breathe at rest in the water. It's cold because the escaping gas freezes, just like a CO2 fire extinguisher would do. And you can look at the reflective tape, and then you also have the oil inflator tube with your left hand. Now, I'm going to say that's filled with carbon dioxide gas, it's not filled with air. But if you want to let the air out, that's the word everybody uses, air, take your pinky finger, your fingernail, and push in the end. So if it's too tight, you can let a little bit out so it's not squeezing you so much. Okay, so you can let it out like that. So if this is an inflatable type 2 wearable personal flotation device by Mustang. Look at that. So you can let some more air out if you want.